how to fix your Wi-Fi not showing on your Dell laptop. So if you're trying to connect to the Wi-Fi and you can't see the Wi-Fi symbol in this bottom taskbar, or you can see the Wi-Fi symbol, but you're just unable to connect, I'm going to show you how we can go in and fix all of these network issues. Now, the very first thing you need to do is open up the start menu on your computer, go in search for services and click on this window here. You then need to scroll right down to the bottom until you see a service called WLAN auto config. Double click on this service and make sure the startup type is set to automatic. Also make sure the service status is running so you can always go and press this start button and then we can press apply and okay. Once you've done that right click on the service and press restart. The next thing you'll need to do is open up the start menu and search for device manager and then click on this window. Click on the drop down arrow next to network adapters and you need to locate your Wi-Fi adapter. So typically it should have Wi-Fi in the name. Mine's this Intel Wi-Fi at the top here. Now the first thing we need to do is go and right click on this, select disable device and then press yes. You can then right click on this again and press enable device and then we're going to right click on it again and press update driver. You can then press search automatically for drivers and once you've done that you can close out of this window and you can check to see if that solves your issue. If it's not working then open up the start menu once again, search for network reset and then click on this option here. You'll then need to press the reset now button and then go and press yes. Now just bear in mind that once you've done this you will need to go and restart your computer. Once your computer's restarted you can once again and check if that solved the issue. Now the next solution is to open up the start menu, search for troubleshoot and click on troubleshoot settings. Click on other troubleshooters, next to network and internet, press run. And now you can go through the steps to try and diagnose any issues with your internet. Once you've done that, open up the start menu once again, search for control panel and then click on this window. In the top right hand side, make sure view by is set to category and then select network and internet. Click on network and share in center and then select change adapter settings in the left hand side. Go and locate your Wi-Fi adapter, so mine's this one here. And we need to make sure this is enabled just by right clicking and if you see an enable button, make sure to go and click this. We're then going to open back up the start menu and go and search for settings and click on this window. In the left hand side select network and internet and make sure error play mode is not turned on and once you've made sure this is toggled off once again close out of this window. Now if you have tried all of the steps so far and your wi-fi is still missing or it's still not working the last solution is just to check for any key combinations on your keyboard that you may have accidentally pressed to turn off the wi-fi. So typically this will be the fn button at the bottom of your keyboard and at the same time of pressing this you need to press one of the F keys on your keyboard just go and look for a Wi-Fi symbol and sometimes this can toggle on and toggle off the Wi-Fi so that's it guys let me know in the comments if you found this video helpful and I'll see you with the next one